In April, USA Today reported that the DEA secretly listens in on billions of Americans' phone calls and that the practice started well before 9-11 and the so-called War on Terror. In fact, almost 90% of wiretaps granted by state and federal courts in 2013 were issued for drug offenses. According to Andy Greenberg of Wired, the program serves as a reminder that most of the legal battles between government surveillance efforts and the Fourth Amendment's privacy protections over the last decades have played out first on the front lines of America's war on drugs. Of course, government surveillance isn't the only controversial criminal justice practice tied to the drug war, but often blamed on terrorism. The list includes gems like providing military gear to police, legalized theft by police via civil asset forfeiture, and the massive number of people in prison for nonviolent drug crimes, especially cannabis. 